Welcome grade twos, this is Mrs. Swanapu and today we are going to look at telling the time and specifically looking at o'clock time. Right then, let's get started. We are going to look at hours and minutes. This is the hour hand. It is the shortest hand on the clock. And this is the minute hand. It is longer than the hour hand. Great twos, can you see that the long minute hand is pointing to the number 12 and it's touching it? And then if we look at the short hand, the hour hand, we can see that it's not touching the number. So it stops in front of the number. When the minute hand is pointing to 12, it is showing a full hour. We call this time o'clock. On this clock, the hour hand is pointing at the 8 and the minute hand is pointing to the 12. This clock is showing that the time is 8 o'clock. Now we're going to play a game and see if we can work out what time it is on the clock. What time is it? First, I'm going to look at the long arm and it's pointing to 12, so that means o'clock. Then I look at the short hour hand and I see that it's pointing to seven. So this means it is seven o'clock. Good. Let's try another one. What time do you think it is? Look at the long arm and look at the short arm. Yes, it is three o'clock. What time is it now? Long arm is pointing at 12 and the short arm is pointing to 11. Yes, it's 11 o'clock. Now what time is it? Let's have a look. The short arm is pointing to 6 to say what hour and the long arm is pointing to the 12 which means o'clock. Yes, you are right. It is six o'clock. And now let's have a look. The long arm is pointing to 12. Short hand is pointing to nine. This means it is nine o'clock. Oh goodness, what is happening now? Now both of the arms are pointing to the same number. But don't worry, the same rules apply. If the long arm is pointing to the 12, that means o'clock. And then we have to look at where the short arm is pointing. And it's also pointing to the 12. So that means it is 12 o'clock. What time is it? Which clock shows 2 o'clock? Let's have a look at the first one. Well, we can see that the long arm is on the right place to say o'clock, but the short arm is pointing to the eight. And what is the short arm? The short arm is the hour hand to show us what hour it is. We are looking for two o'clock and this one is pointing to the eight. So this means the first clock is eight o'clock. So no, it's not this one we want. Let's look at the clock in the middle. This clock says what time? Yes, the 12, the long arm is pointing to the 12, so this means our clock, but the short hour hand is pointing to the 3, so this clock says it is 3 o'clock. Now let's look at the last clock. This surely has to be it, but let's just make sure. The long arm is pointing to the 12, which says O clock, and the short arm is pointing to the two. So this means this clock says two o'clock and that's the one we wanted. Let's go again. What time is it? Which clock shows four o'clock? Now if we look at all three of these clocks, we see that the long arms are pointing to the 12 to say it is o'clock. So now we only have to find the correct hour hand pointing to four to say that it is four o'clock. Can you spot the correct clock? Yes, it's the first one. Well done. What time is it? Which clock shows 
10 o'clock. Remember what I said about the long arm pointing to the 12, which means o'clock? So now we only have to look for the hour hand pointing to the 10. So guess, which one is showing 10 o'clock? Is it the first one? No. Is it the last one? No, also not. Is it the middle clock? Yes. The middle clock shows us it is 10 o'clock. What time is it? Which clock shows 3 o'clock? I want you to look carefully. Let's make sure all of the long arms are pointing to the 12, which means o'clock. Now search for 3 o'clock. Is it the last one? No. Is it the middle clock? Yes. It's the middle clock. The long arm is pointing to 12, which means o'clock. And the short hour hand is pointing to 3. So this clock shows us 3 o'clock. Well done, grade twos. I hope you've enjoyed learning how to tell time with me. Please stay safe until next time. Bye.